Mardi Gras organizations that parade in Daphne will notice some changes with what they are allowed to throw in next year's parades. As WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explains, a 20-year city ordinance is being overhauled to keep up with the times. Mardi Gras is a big part of life on the Gulf Coast. Each year, thousands of people line the streets in Old Town Daphne, catching throws and letting the good times roll. You know, we've got one organization that's over 22 years parading on the Shadow Barons. The uh, uh, Apollo's Mystic Ladies is right behind that. As the celebrations grow each year, Mayor Robin Lejeune wants to take a closer look at the city's current ordinance, though, and make a few changes. We're trying to be more common sense yeah. here, you know, and so. You know, uh, somebody trying to throw five pound bag at somebody or, or something like that. Look, we, we want to be a little more cautious there. Right now, there are no restrictions on how heavy throws can be, but Mayor Lejeune would like to keep throws under two pounds. He says there haven't been any issues in the past, but he wants to make sure everyone stays safe. The organizations are very good at policing themselves. Our police officers work with the organizations as they walk along the parade. If they see something out of line, they let the organization know. The Daphne City Council will vote on the changes next month on November 7th. Another change would do away with outdated language in the current ordinance. One item in particular prohibits moon pies made in other countries from being thrown. Lejeune says it's been 20 years since the ordinance has been reviewed. We don't know what the time frame was at that time, what was going on, if there was an issue. This is really just clarifying and cleaning up. So then they're, they're better understanding of what they need to do. He expects city council members to approve the changes without any objection. In Daphne, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.